So, man, you ready for the big game tonight or what? I don't know. We have to play Blair Oaks. What do you, what do you mean? Like, we worked so hard all, all season for this, man. We got it. I don't know. Hey, boys, good luck tonight. Here's some good luck chocolate. I'm so lucky about chocolate. Haven't you ever heard of Harley and the Chocolate Factory? Mm -mm. No. Just watch this. Now, this is a story all about how my life got flipped, turned upside down. I'd like to take a minute, just sit right there. I'll tell you how I was a part of the Chocolate Factory affair. In cartoon world, I was born and raised. In the candy store is where I spent most of my days. Chilling out, maxing, eating candy all cool, and going to watch the homecoming game after school. When a couple of kids who were up to no good started winning gold tickets in my neighborhood. I got one too, but I wasn't scared. I said, I'm going to the chocolate factory. I don't care. I met Oompa Loompas and Willy Wonka came near. There was a rude girl named Veruca, yeah, she kind of made me fear. Then Violet turned purple and I thought that was kind of rare, but I thought, nah, forget it, it's the Chocolate Factory Affair. I made it through the factory by seven or eight, and I yelled to the others, you lose, smell you later. I looked at my kingdom and I was finally there. Yeah, I don't care, Chocolate Factory Affair. Oh, I think I get it now. See, Harley survived the chocolate factory because she worked hard for her accomplishments. Just like you guys, your team has worked hard all year, and tonight is going to be your big night. Thanks for the pep talk, girls. Let's go ruffle some fucking feathers! Yeah! <laughs> <laughs>